guys, welcome back to another video. It's Captain Friday. Today I'm going to be reviewing Drisham 1 and Drisham 2. So both of them are Malayalam movies and both movies star Mohanlal and some other actors that uh, I don't know, I don't really remember their names, but I can remember the one, like the main character was George Kuti in the uh, movie. His name was George Kuti, but he is Mohanlal and he's a very famous, renowned Indian actor and I personally very much like him. He's an amazing actor and he performs awesomely. So without further ado, let's get into the review. Usually when a sequel of a movie comes out, you'll have very high expectations for it. Usually the sequel won't always match up to the first part. And so I'm going to tell you my verdict on the sequel of Drishyam. Drishyam 1 actually released 7 years ago but I watched it last week and overall it was an amazing film. The main character is George Kuti, played by Mohanlal, and he has to protect his family from a murder that had taken place. He does this by making many clever decisions, and he's always at the edge of getting caught by the cops. It's a thriller, and it kept me at the edge of my seat the entire time. It was a gripping movie, and I thought it was pretty amazing to watch. Seven years after the first film release, they announced a sequel called Drishyam 2 The Resumption. And since I was so amazed by the first movie, I was very excited to see the second one. It actually got released on February 19, 2021 on Prime Video, so you can watch it now if you have Prime Video subscription. And I watched the movie and I really, really liked it. The first half of the movie is just about his ordinary life. Now he owns a theater and he's a film producer and just shows his life after the events that happened during the first film. After the first half, a really big twist happens. This shocked me and I was actually clapping because it was really amazing to see what happened. I think that Drishyam 2 was a little less better than Drishyam 1 because first of all, there were some unrealistic parts that you couldn't really imagine happening in real life as in Drishyam 1, there were more parts that you could say were, that could happen in real life. But in Drishyam 2, the events kind of made the story unbelievable. So yeah, that's why I kind of say that it's a little less better than Drishyam 1. But overall, I think it's pretty good. It's a really good movie. I really recommend you to watch it. There are new characters and they have a big role in the movie and that really brings up new obstacles for George Kuti, but he can handle it. He gets away with the crime, somehow he does it because he's really clever. He's only studied till fourth grade, but he still manages to put up such a big hoax and it, it's really an amazing thing to see someone do something like this. Well, this was my review of Drishyam 2. If you enjoyed this, please make sure to smash that subscribe button and also like, comment, and share this video with everyone you know. And I hope you have a fantastic day. See you guys later. Maybe my compass was wrong And I'm still on my way Lost in these days where I belong